breaking news over on the Big Island. Those who live in the Pu'ukapu Hawaiian homestead in Kamuela are being asked to evacuate. That's due to a large brush fire in the area. Waikiki residents and folks who live close enough to see the flames should also be prepared to evacuate. Officials say the fire has burned more than 12,000 acres so far and continues to shift direction based on wind conditions. Officials have opened a shelter at Waimea District Park. Old Saddle Road has been closed between Highway 190 and Daniel K. Inouye Highway and is also closed. For more on the conditions, let's send things over to Kamako Bealy for the latest. Kamako. Sam, you know, this fire has been turning into something more extreme where we are actually starting to register this on our visible satellite. We zoom in a bit, we can look right in that Pu'ukapu area, that Waimea area, this plume that's starting to move, and you can see that line starting to make its way out towards the west. That's all associated with this system. And even on the Doppler radar, we usually see these things, and once we get to the oranges and the reds, more thunderstorm activity, heavy downpours, but all of this is that smoke and the fire that's burning in that particular area. Now, this is not a good time to be doing this, uh, to have this type of uh, activity. Of course, not much shower activity. If you actually go back on this radar, we don't see any rain coming through. And across the islands today, it was very little. In this particular area, the gauge within the past 24 hours was only about a tenth of an inch. Within the past 12 hours, not much coming down at all. Now, it's a really, in terms of the location, not a very good location either because that's just the area of the island that's more in the severe conditions compared to the rest of the island. That's about 6% of the island right now in Hawaii. The only place that's not seeing any drought conditions is that south side of Hawaii Island. Of course, that's the area that's experiencing the afternoon showers now, and that's what's uh, giving to their wet season.